So we're going to take you out to Naples to Mike Grella. Um, Mike, we've been watching your Instagram the last couple of days. Seems like you had an eventful night. Is that right? Wild night, yeah. We, they started singing and chanting at 11 p.m. And I thought it was over at 12, but then the fireworks started going on. And they were not little fireworks, they were big fireworks. The most impressive thing was when they got rid of the firework holder and started holding it with their hands instead and directed them right at the, uh, right at the hotel windows. So it was a difficult night. Uh, spoke to some of the, you know, and, and read about some of the Milan players and fans. They said they slept fine. But I did speak to a guy today that said, hey, at 2 a.m., I did hear a couple big bombs. Did, uh, do you feel like CBS did this to you purposely? Why would they put you in the AC Milan hotel? I have no idea why they put me there. I'm still asking Tony these questions now. But I got to say, this place is magical. It's loud. I love being here. I love being at CBS, especially because I get to work <laughs> with the world's best, most stunning, number one TV football host. Where is she? Where's Jules? <laughs> <laughs> Jules is not here today, man. Yeah. <laughs> Mike, you got the wrong one. You got the wrong was, show. Hey, I was talking about Poppy Miller in the Serie A. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, them bags under your eyes. They're bigger than big cheeks. <laughs>